An entrance to me is a, is a, is a, um, a starting point, the beginning of something, um, a beginning of an adventure, uh, an arrival. Um, it's also a moment of pause before you enter uh, the home that you arrived at or when you return to your own home. Um, like hotel lobbies, which I find to be one of the most interesting rooms in the world to spend time in, um, because it is a momentary home and, and place for everyone there, apart from those who work there. Um, it's a great place to people watch. Um, but it's also uh, a beginning, of a great place to begin an adventure. And the entrance to a home is, is much the same way. Obviously, this, this, this house is also about expressing myself, um, showing my perception of the world and, and showing, sharing my experience. Um, and I use these, the walls and this space as a, as a canvas um, for my story. And I love to invite people in. That's the difference between having, living a public life and a private life, is that in a private life you, you make your own choice uh, about who you share your story with. Uh, and, and I would love for this place to be filled with my friends every day of the week. I was always a great admirer of, um, of Bob Dylan and, and over the years I've, I've through connections, I've had a couple of opportunities to meet him, and I always opted out, um, chickened out, you might say, um, mostly because I, I've, I've met other famous people in my life, and, and very often you walk away somewhat disappointed, or they didn't match the image in your mind, or whatever. But anyway, so over the years, I've, I've had these opportunities, and I said no. And one day, after a concert, uh, Bob Dylan's uh, road manager gave me this, I said, this is for you, for Mr. D, next time, step up. I think the greatest compliment I ever had for, for, you know, for this place, I'm not looking for compliments, but you know, um, was a, a child. We, um, there were some guests here and there was a small child and everybody had ended up in the kitchen. And I wanted everybody to go into the rest of the apartment. And so at one point I, I simply said, all right, everybody leave, let's go in next door. And this little girl turned and said to her mom, but mom, we don't have a ticket. <laughs> and I just love that because that is, that is I, I felt that perhaps if, if, if people think of this as sort of a, 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 you know, a, a weird, crazy out there museum of madness, then that's perfectly fine with me.